welcome back to the channel. Today we just wanted to share with you guys some projects we've been working on. There's two books actually. A children's book and an adventure log book. The children's book is called My Home the Smokies um, and we just wanted to create something to get our nieces and nephews like interested in the outdoors and the Smokies and share some of like because uh, we think that the Smokies, like the Smokies are really important to us and yeah. we wanted to share that with our nieces and nephews and, and other kids. Like I think that it's important for kids to know about nature um, and to get out in nature. I think that's very important. Uh, but my home, the Smokies, we were walking at yeah, the, track the track at home and we were just talking about different things, talking about the Smokies and we had had the idea to like write a We a were just talking about, about how we wanted to get our nieces and nephews like, you know, to enjoy nature and mm -hmm. stuff because not necessarily they spend a lot of time outside and we wanted to get them interested in it yeah. and they're still young but uh so yeah I was just like we should write a children's book and she's like we don't got any kids like we got a lot of nieces and nephews <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and so, um that's where that came about yeah. and so we, we had the idea left. of about about the animals in the Smokies because yeah. um like our niece our nephews really like animals so do our nieces and so we thought about the animals in the Smokies and we thought about how we could incorporate that into a children's book. Yeah. And so um, we talk about different the different animals that are in the Smokies. It's led by a bear named Barry. Um, and he tells you about his, his friends in the Smokies. So the different animals um, tells you about how they impact, how they are important to the ecosystem of the Smokies. And just a couple of facts about them. Um, and so, yeah, that was something we thought was really cool. It took us a little bit. We had to get the illustrations done. And, put the ideas together and write the pages and all that um, but it was a really fun process I really liked so it. So now all of our ne ne nephews and nieces have a copy and <laughs> yep. we really like it. So <laughs> the other book we worked on was something more for me and Rachel was uh, an adventure log book and we designed it to where it isn't just for hiking you can actually it's got like a place where you can write your day the activity you did so if you were like going you know on a biking trail you could be like bike whatever trail today or hike this trail or whatnot. So camping, hiking, biking, anything outdoors. Then you have like the location where it was at, like maybe a park or a national park or whatnot. Then you have a little rating system and we chose like Christmas trees. I like, you know, fern, the big oak, <laughs> like <laughs> Fraser firs and stuff. Yeah, his favorite um, trees are the, um, these like on the, the book. evergreen <laughs> trees in the Smokies, yeah. Yeah, actually those are my favorite trees in the Smokies. So if you're familiar with the highway that runs from uh, Cherokee to Gatlinburg, those trees are on the overlook and I always take you know, pictures of them so that's what I went with for the book because like I said it was mostly for me and Rachel but, mm -hmm. but considered we like this kind of stuff I figured you know why not just you know put it on Amazon and you know if y'all want to get one you can um, also it has a spot in here to where you can write down your memories and impressions it's got a bunch of lines there and each each like trail or whatever you did has all that stuff where you could log the different activities in the rating system or whatnot and then the very next page is a sketch so you can also add notes there if you wanted to or you could you know sketch so or you could uh like if you've got like one of those little cameras print out your pictures put yeah, them in or there or a sticker from yeah, maybe a sticker. story you could stick in there but rachel, we did uh cummings falls or cummings, cummings, cummings falls, falls yesterday in tennessee. in tennessee and rachel did an amazing sketch <laughs> <laughs> not an amazing sketch Horrible. But that's the first time we actually got to use it, so yeah. we thought it was pretty cool. Um, but yeah, we'll have the links for both of these books in our descriptions and in the pinned comment of this video. So if you want to pick one up for someone who loves the outdoors or want to get one of your children interested okay. in the outdoors or yeah. something that like the Smokies, you get them, give them some more knowledge about it. Uh -huh. I mean, more than likely you'll probably learn something about the Smokies as well because yeah. as we were doing research for this book, we learned a good bit. Mm -hmm. And yeah, so if you want to get one. Or if one, you want to get like a stocking stuffer for your uh, adventure friends and put that in their stockings. Honestly, might like, buy a couple of these and give them to my friends. That's a good idea. <laughs> but <laughs> but yeah, we've got, we really enjoyed like the creative process of, of making both of these books and definitely have a lot more ideas of oh, things yeah. that we would like and want to create. So it was really fun. We really enjoyed it. But we hope you guys will check them out. We'll leave them in the description below. Thank you guys who have already bought this book we and supported it. it. We really, really appreciate it. So thank you guys. Hope you enjoy them.